everyone. This is Wendy James and Love Dragons, and this is only the second time or third time I've ever gone live. But I'm about to do a project that's super exciting, and I'm going to do a live 365-day gratitude journal on here. And each day, even just for a couple minutes, two to three minutes, I'm going to pop on and I'm going to talk about gratitude. And I assure you that there are going to be days where I'm going to look crazy because this is a big commitment, but it's the spring equinox. It's a perfect time to start such a healthy, soulful project for me and hopefully inspiring you to think about on a daily basis things you're grateful for. It's a great way to start the day. It's a great way to spend time throughout the day, especially if you're facing stress or things, is to stop from time to time and think about what you are grateful for. I have such a huge list. I have so many things. First off, I'm so grateful for the opportunity to be expressing this publicly and not just in my journal myself, which I've done, but it's so nice to be able to share my own expansion and what I'm learning and how challenging this might be um, over time with all of you. So I'm so grateful to have that opportunity. But I am also grateful for this equinox. It has been a good year. It has been a great winter and here comes spring and all the bulbs and all the flowers and all of that is so much to look forward to. I'm grateful for health and well-being and, and that I have another grandbaby coming. This is going to be grandbaby number five born in August. So this is going to be a great year for all of us. I've got new business projects coming up. I'm going to have all of that being announced on the Love Dragons Facebook page and on our website, lovedragons.ca, L-U-V-D-R-A-G-O-N-S dot C-A. So thank you for being here. Thank you for following. Share this with people that might need to also be reminded to find things that they're grateful for on the daily. I'll be popping in for only two to three minutes uh, talking about my great gratitude and what I appreciate. Today is day number one. And of course, I am over the moon at this um, challenge and a little nervous about it. I'm going to be honest, I'm, I'm nervous about the size of the commitment because sometimes I have commitment issues. Sometimes I fall off of um, standing up and just handling, handling business all the time. Sometimes I fall back a little bit. I've been doing this for 26 years. I'm in my 26th year. Gratitude beyond for my clients, for my followers, for everybody who's been involved with Love Dragons. We've done all, so many corporate, ev corporate events. I've had the pleasure and the blessing of coaching several people. And I got to say, I am so grateful for the age I am. I am 53 and so grateful to be at this place in my life where I'm self-propelled. I'm an entrepreneur, work for myself. I'm surrounded by good, strong people in my life. And I am in such a great mindset that I want to express gratitude on the daily with all of you. So share if you like this, if you're jazzed by it, and certainly know 365, now 364 more days, I'm going to be popping on and reminding you also, find gratitude, wake up with those thoughts, think about the fact that you have a roof over your head, you got food on your table, that you've got love in your life, friendships, health, whatever it is, even if things are going wrong, even if they're stressful, be grateful that you have the challenges in front of you to be able to trust yourself to be able to handle those things and to be able to face your day from a place of appreciation, even when there's conflict. They're teaching us things, these conflicts. Have a great day, everyone. Thank you for being here.